In the field, always stuck inside my fields, feeling low, don't help with all the snow inside my wheels. Think I need to go and bail. I ain't talking about a jail, but I'm steady locked in. Gonna do this shit for real. Bills getting paid when I hop up on that plane, making meals to the grave. Smoke blowing at the face, levitating from the grape, and that's all I really need. It would happen over a decade ago at WrestleMania 20 when Brock Lesnar and Goldberg would square off for the very first time. Two behemoths in the business set to go one on one. That very night, the fans shit on the entire match. And guess what? Stone Cold Steve Austin ended up stunning them both, devaluing the credibility of both superstars. Their second outing, Survivor Series 2016. Goldberg would have a tremendous return to the company. And now, here we go. After Goldberg beat Brock Lesnar in mere seconds at the annual traditional uh, Thanksgiving uh, spectacle. Now it's time for WrestleMania 33 here in Orlando, Florida. And now Goldberg. Goldberg is looking to become not just the first ever Universal Champion to defend the championship belt at WrestleMania, but also the first to ever retain the gold. And right now, Brock Lesnar delivering the pain. His moniker used to be, here comes the pain. Can that retain as a feeling, as a moniker here tonight at WrestleMania? And look at this, wait a second, Lesnar picking him up like yesterday's garbage. And one more time. The backbreaker is a tremendous maneuver. And right here, this must be where he learned that MMA. He was gonna go for those elbows, but Goldberg has a little bit of training in mixed martial arts as well. And that's why you saw that kick happen just right now here in Orlando, Florida. And look at this, look at the shots. And he knows, Goldberg knows that Brock Lesnar previously suffered from diverticulitis. And he went for those two right hands, uh, a right hand and a left hand, I apologize, to the gut area. And right now, oh my, Goldberg sent flailing to the outside as Lesnar is attempting for his first win against Goldberg. Oh boy, look at that shot right there. A humongous powerbomb, another one on the outside floor, don't tell me. Oh my, Goldberg has a damn family, guys. And Brock Lesnar does not care. Much like Brock Lesnar didn't care that he Slater had kids, Brock Lesnar certainly cares less, even much so, that Goldberg has children of his own. And right now, Lesnar. Lesnar, perched up. Goldberg in big trouble here. And, oh my. He sent him flying. Now that's a WrestleMania moment. One, no. Goldberg kicks out, but barely. Even though it was after the one count. And Goldberg, oh wait a second. Lesnar being arrogant. And that's what you get because Goldberg just fought right back. And now with a single underhook. And now spins Lesnar. What a pump handle flip slam. And get that weasel. Off of that ring apron, that walrus, and that allowed Lesnar, the distraction, to capitalize on the 50-year-old Universal Champion. My goodness, what a match so far. A much longer affair than we are used to now. Look at this. Oh, my. You want to talk about Suplex City, ladies and gentlemen. 
Goldberg is going for a thrill ride. We call WrestleMania the ultimate thrill ride. And guess what? Goldberg went for just that. The ultimate thrill ride. And Lesnar perched. He's ready to deliver an F5. No, Goldberg. Oh, my. Goldberg really absolutely. Wait a second. Not already. The jackhammer. The jackhammer. He polished off Goldberg at the Survivor Series with this maneuver. Two and no. Goldberg kicks out. Or sorry, Brock Lesnar kicks out. We're live, ladies and gentlemen. No time for flops. Vince McMahon in my ear. And a follow-away slam. Lesnar could not defeat Goldberg. Wait a second, a cover. No. Could not defeat Goldberg over a decade ago at WrestleMania 20, a landmark event. And Survivor Series 2016 lost in mere seconds. Now it's time for Lesnar to regain his composure. And that's exactly what he's doing. He's younger, he's stronger, and more relevant than Goldberg has ever been. He is a legitimate fighter. UFC, multiple time champion, defeating the likes of Heath Herring, defeating the likes of Randy Couture. Lesnar is a beast, defeating the likes of Mark Hunt, although that match was marred by the fact that Lesnar was on some sort of growth hormone drug. Wait a second, Goldberg with a huge spine buster, spine of the pine by the former Atlanta native. And here we go. But anyway, talking about Mark Hunt, Lesnar demolished him in a huge fight until later he was discovered that he was using growth hormone enhancers. Goldberg's not gonna allow that to happen as Lesnar is being measured. Goldberg is a father. He is a family man. He is he has once said that he is returning only to WrestleMania and only to the WWE so his child can witness his rise on the top of the world of professional wrestling. And Goldberg, Goldberg now, not waiting. Wait a second, Lesnar coming back. And he's coming back strong. A nice martial arts kick to the back there. And Lesnar, who is the bigger beast? Obviously, Lesnar calls himself the Beast Unleashed. But is Goldberg the real beast here, defeating the Beast twice now at two different events. WrestleMania over 10 years ago and Survivor Series of 2016. This is the rubber match, as they like to call it. This is the ultimate grudge match at the ultimate thrill ride. It's WrestleMania! Right now, bad camera angle here as the action is too fast to call and is moving too fast. I believe that was a power slam. I wish the crane would move a little bit to the right, really to make sure that everything is still happening the way it should be happening. Goldberg sent careening back into the ring. And now Lesnar, Lesnar going for a cover a la WrestleMania 7 Ultimate Warrior. And no, Ultimate Warrior pinned the Macho Man Randy Savage after careening him outside the ring, taking him back in and pinning him with one foot, retiring the Macho Man from the world of professional wrestling forever. Wait a second, wait a second, here we go. F5, Shades of Raw, Shades of Raw. Here we go, one, two, and no, kick out by Goldberg. Goldberg is an absolute force to be reckoned with, but Lesnar is as well. These two are frequently known as beasts, Most, uh, boasting huge wins in their respective careers, but Goldberg coming back. Goldberg is coming back. And Goldberg now, what is Goldberg doing here, folks? Goldberg is measuring in a nice clothesline, almost decapitating Brock Lesnar. Wait a second, could he be? Could he be going? No, a right hand, another one. Rocking the giant. And look at this. These two are beating the holy hell out of each other. 
Oh my, a little overzealous on Goldberg's part. Head first into the turnbuckle, allowing Lesnar to do a fantastic Northern Lights suplex. Sorry, a gut wrench suplex. McMahon again in my ear, correcting everything that I say. A follow-away slam, that's the second time we've seen that one in this match, folks. And now Goldberg. Oh, Goldberg with a huge crescent kick to the gut of Lesnar, again working on that disease known as diverticulitis. And uh-oh, it's time for the ultimate thrill ride version two. Goldberg taking more bumps in this match than really he has in over 10 years and he no sold it. He doesn't know how to sell, guys. He took those suplexes and he rolled right out impervious to the pain. And Goldberg coming back, oh my. My goodness, here we go, uh-oh. Nice move there by the 97 veteran of Monday Night Nitro. And wait a second, that damn walrus again. And oh my goodness, being tossed around like a rag doll. And it's all because of that walrus, Paul Heyman, looking for Larry, more like looking for Goldberg. Lesnar is going to town, going to work on the former WCW World Champion. And yes, it's time. No, Goldberg elbowing his way out of the, oh boy, look at this. Now, wait a second, a little miscommunication, but Goldberg with a huge drop kick. We don't see a big man like that perform a move so agile. And yes, he speared him right out of his boots, folks. Spearing him right out of his boots, and Brock Lesnar is in trouble. Oh, could it be? Could it be? It's jackhammer time, folks. Could he retain the Universal Championship? Right here at WrestleMania 33. Two. No. Lesnar kicked out. Oh my goodness, what a match. No. Oh, well, if it doesn't work twice, it'll work three times. Goldberg. Lesnar up and down. Jack Hammer City. And the ref in position. Two. No. Goldberg cannot keep the beast down. And look at Paul Heyman's face. It is seething in red, and Goldberg even feeling a little bit off his game, perhaps. How is he going to defeat this man? That's what I'm wondering. And wait a second, Goldberg in trouble again. Back into the ring. What could this be? Oh, oh. And Lesnar now. Lesnar is absolutely one of the most deadly forces here in professional wrestling. WrestleMania, choking Goldberg. He'll do anything for that universal gold. And he's doing it right now. What's gonna happen? Lesnar measuring, boom, right across the back. My goodness, what a match so far that we're witnessing here. Look at this. One more time, right across the back. And that's gonna cause a little bit of vertebrae issue. Wait a second. Lesnar was going for something there. But Goldberg able to come back. My, oh no, come on. Someone eject that walrus out of here. This is WrestleMania 33 in Orlando, Florida. And oh no, the distraction was able to, no. Goldberg getting out of it. And a little bit of a bit, no, my. That's even worse than a German suplex. He flipped him 360 all the way around. Goldberg in big trouble here as Lesnar looking, oh wait, he's busted, he's busted. Get the white gloves out, ref. Get the white gloves out. This is WrestleMania. Family friendly content, the ultimate thrill ride. And he's bleeding profusely from the top of his head. This is bad news here for Goldberg fans, but he's back. Could this be it? Could this be it? Right here, up 
And down. Jackhammer. If I'm counting correctly, that is four jackhammers. In position, Universal Champion retains the gold here tonight at WrestleMania. The ultimate thrill ride turned out to be just that for Brock Lesnar, who after three attempts now has not been able to defeat Goldberg. Remember, this is the man that defeated The Undertaker. This is the man that conquered the big show at the Royal Rumble. But this is the man that will forever be known as the individual, the man, the conqueror, the beast who is unable to slay Goldberg, the Universal Champion. And let's see what happened. Up and down. And that was all she wrote here at this WrestleMania event. Thanks for joining me on this video. And thanks so much for being a WWE fan. Goldberg with the victory tonight. He is our Universal Champion. The championship retained over some game competition. This was an awesome match and a great win. To get the pinfall victory over such a high quality opponent is incredibly impressive, Michael. What a match that was, ladies and gentlemen. Thanks for joining us.